The SpongeBob movie, Sponge Out of Water. I think I'm talking about this because I actually been wanting to watch this. I, the original movie, I love the original SpongeBob movie. I saw it and see this. I'm actually looking for a copy if I find that. I'm definitely going to review it at some point. That'd be fun to watch, but I've never seen this one. So I was like, I kind of, when I found this super cheap, I had to pick it up and, and give it a watch. Because I was really, there's a lot of things I know about this movie. I know they go into the real world and stuff for some of it. Um, had a lot more animation. They were in a lot more animation actually, when it comes to the beginning of the first half. Most of the movie was in like, they weren't in the real world as long as I thought they were. I thought they were going to be in that more. Because I thought I remember the career that I started having more of that. But it's actually a really still cool movie. Um, I really enjoyed it. And also, it's not really for a look. I think it's, people have said it. But it is also really cool to have nice Peter and Lloyd do like a little rap thing at the end with the dolphin. That was actually really cool that they wrote. Cool. And also, they were in it for one scene. It cuts to a scene. And you see them in it. As a big background fan, that's the one. That's not the only reason I got this movie, though. I mean, I knew they were in it, but even if they won, I still probably would have picked this up because it's one I wanted to see. It was actually really good throughout the entire thing, so I really enjoyed it. Um, yeah, so I think it's a really good movie. Definitely, if you like SpongeBob, check it out. Exactly. I'm surprised how good it is compared to. It's not as good as I think the original one because the original one, like, it's the first. It's so. It has something about it, it's just so great. I think one's actually really good, though. I would give it, like, it's definitely it's a great second movie. It's not bad, way better than I thought of. I thought it was, it's always going to be, especially with how Spongebob, I know people have not been doing the show as much, or had certain problems with the show, like the show has had some weak points, so I think it's doing maybe that now, I'm not sure, but the movie was actually really good, but let's jump into talking about the movie, and maybe getting, and I'm going to say spoiler warning, just in case I spoil anything that you might want to know. I'm not going to spoil the end, but in case I spoil, unless I say something that might be a spoiler, give me a warning. Uh, this movie is about Bumbuck Grow Pants. Uh, he there's this pirate guy who gets this m book, and basically he and it's like he's telling the SpongeBob story, and then uh, SpongeBob gets the um, and Plank and it starts off with like in the when he goes to the animation world, SpongeBob and Plank became bomb and stuff with SpongeBob biting Plankton to get because Plankton finally gets the secret formula and stuff, and then it disappears. And everything goes into anarchy, and they think Plankton did it. And no, Spongebob, no. Hey, I know you didn't do it. I was there. You didn't steal it. I was there too. He didn't steal it. Everybody thinks he did. But bad Spongebob and bad Spongebob and everybody. Spongebob sides with him. They get off. Everybody's after him because they uh, think they stole it. It involves time travel for something I was not expecting. To, to think that I was not expecting this movie. Time travel was not one of them. Higher beings of power was something else I was not expecting for this movie. A lot of I was expecting in this movie, but this is really great. Bought the elliptic now. As likely I would say this is this should be a this is for mild action, or there is mild action, so that makes sense. And rude humor. I would say yeah. Tell me to you might not be super soon, yeah. I wouldn't say this movie you should put on for like a four year old or really really young kid, but you know, like your average kid can watch this fine. It was a fun movie, I really enjoyed it, so let's jump into rating. This one, I almost want to give it, I don't know what I want to give this, because this is like a really good movie, I actually really enjoyed it. I'm like thinking, because this is like eating a 9 out of 10, obviously. Definitely gets it's better than an 8. I do, I, like, the original, I think we're going to give it a 9. This is a 9. Because I know the original one's a 10 for me, so I think we'll just give this one a 9. Because I do think that one is better, because I think that one's better than this one. I think one else means it has to be a little less. I think it's a 9. It's really good. I actually want to watch this again. This is actually really freaking good. I'm surprised how good that was. It was funny. It had a lot of references to the show. Comedy was great. It's a cool concept. It's a cool. I actually really enjoyed it. And I know they're doing, I think, another one. But the movie. So if they do that, I'll review that at some point. But thank you guys for watching. You guys can always stay happy. We'll see you in the next movie review. Bye. Bye. If you look short. But I'm trying to make these short. Bye.